Hey, it's Steve. This is episode four, and uh, this is this is a this is a difficult one. Um, this came from a, a person named Jesse, and she wrote or he wrote. I'm not sure. Jesse is kind of one of those ambiguous things. But Jesse writes, "Dear Steve, uh, my name is Jesse, and I'm an openly proud gay 13 year old. I've always known I was gay, but recently accepted myself, like a year and a couple months." ago, I'm guessing they meant to write. My family, except for me, are Catholic and very religious, and I wanted to come out for like a month or so to my family, but I don't know how, like every time I try the words I'm gay, just don't come out. Please help me. Okay, so Jesse, let's talk about a couple different things first. Number one, they're very religious. Um, hopefully that doesn't mean that if you come out, uh, your situation will become like super difficult, because you're only 13. I mean, you're gonna be in that household for, you know, like another five years or so until you're 18, perhaps. Um, so be really careful. If, it, if it's gonna cause a lot of stuff, sometimes waiting is the best option. I know that sounds horrible to say. I'm a huge advocate of everyone coming out, but there are unique situations where coming out can really just mess you up. And that might happen when you're 13 and your parents don't accept that part of you. If it's something that you need to do, that you feel that you have to do, then let's talk about the actual coming out. The words, I'm gay, are just so, they get caught like right here, don't they? And they feel like they're choking you a little bit and you're like, ah. I'm gay, I'm gay, I'm gay. Get it out as, as, in as few words as possible. Because what happens is there's a lot of disclaimer that happens with coming out. You'd be like, hey, like, uh, can you sit down? Like, I, I need to talk to you. Like, this is, it means a lot to me. Um, and I need to get it off my chest. And, and you know, like all of that stuff just causes unnecessary anxiety. So sometimes I think the best thing to do is just get the words out and then try to talk. Um, because talking before coming out is really just you like stalling. It doesn't do anything for the person you're talking to. Like if, uh, like for instance, I'm talking to myself right now. So if I was like, hey Steve, uh, I, I gotta tell you something. And I was like, okay, yeah, of course, sit down. And you'd be like, all right, well, uh, well, Oliver, I, I gotta, I gotta tell you, man, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm gay. <laughs> Hopefully that doesn't happen to you. Um, Oliver, Oliver hasn't had his coffee yet. Um, it's important, it's important just to get the words out, you know? I mean, getting them out of your throat is, is the hardest part. Um, getting them out of the, where they get lodged right here, getting them out is the hardest part. Maybe a, a quick pep talk in the mirror. That I've done that, I've definitely done that before coming out. I'd be in the mirror and I'd be like, all right, Steve, like we're gonna do this. You're, gonna, you're, gonna, you're just gonna come out, you're, gonna, you're, just gonna, you're just gonna tell them, you're gonna tell them and it's gonna be fine. But it's awesome, I mean, you're an openly gay 13 year old, congratulations, coming out early has gotta be like one of the coolest things a person can do because it's such bravery at such a young age. Um, so just, you know, like own it, own it, you know? Own it and, and show your parents, hey, like I'm still the same, still the same kid, still love you guys, um, but I'm gay and I, I, need, I need you guys to know that. And, and hopefully it works out for the best. Um, you know, uh, write me again. If you if you do write me, I want to I want to hear how it works out. Maybe we can go from there again uh, in the future. So Jesse, good luck. Um, I think what you're doing is incredibly brave. Be very very careful. Make sure that uh, it's a calculated decision, and try to make sure that you have Plan B if it doesn't go exactly how you need it to. If you have a friend's place you can stay at for a little bit, um, just be safe. Be safe, but do you? You know, if it's important to you, then it's important to you, and it should be. Um, but but make sure you do it. You know, well. Think it out. Make sure it's a good, you know, it's the right decision to make at that time. Right, Oliver? Can't believe you slapped me. All right, well, thank you so much for watching. Jesse, I hope that helped. Um, and good luck with the family. Uh, and I'll talk to you soon, hopefully. Write me a follow-up email if you do come out to them. I want to hear what happens. All right, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.